In this video, I want to talk about 15 different business ideas that would make you money in Ghana's real estate. What is the first thing that comes to your mind when you hear the word real estate or property? The first thing that usually comes to the mind of many people is developer. Like you can actually become somebody that develop a house and then you can make money from that. What many people don't know is that there are a lot of other ways that you can actually make money from real estate industry without being the one that will build a house. My first business idea in Ghana real estate is smart home. The world we now live in is ruled by technology, is ruled by artificial intelligence. And there are a lot of people now who are really very passionate about how this cool tech and all these gadgets, they want them in their home. Literally, in some home you can actually, you know, maybe Maybe your finger like that and then you can turn the light on or you can actually you know use your voice to actually open the curtain you know all of this you know it comes with you know a lot of um, technology it comes with a lot of um, expert knowledge and you can actually become expert you can just learn and become expert and pick your idea I mean you're not going to sit in your house and start making money um, doing smart home you have to pick your idea and you have to look for people that we actually want your service especially for example you know you have developer who just develop home and they just build the house and that's all they do but you can actually become um, an expert that people will be looking for you developer will actually be looking for you they will want you to come and um, help their clan to actually make their home smart so that is the first one so the second idea for me is a management agency so you know you can actually become a management agent. Um, so what do I mean by this? This is something that has been around for a long time. It's just that you have to put a touch of excellence into what you do. So for example, you know, there are people that actually even have their landlords, but they don't really want to be doing all these hazards of dealing with a tenant, or maybe they have a BNB, and b they might be there in America somewhere or in Europe somewhere but you can actually become a management agent and then you'll be helping all these people and a lot of tourists are actually coming to ghana so and you know all these people that have um, um hair b and b they might not actually be living in ghana and then you can actually become a, a management agent that will be helping people to look after their property and you can make money through that and my next idea has to do with land you can actually become a middleman so you can help people to buy land you can become a middleman between you know people that own land and people that want to buy land how about helping people that want to move house because a lot of people are moving they move from one house to another house it might actually be offices actually it might be somebody moving from one office to another office and sometimes it's really very too tedious it's very um, annoying job to do to actually move all your thing yourself to a one particular location to another location you can actually become uh, helping people to move house and that is a big business as well it's a big industry in terms of like, it's a sub you know industry itself in the real estate industry you can surely become a blogger so what do i mean by this you know i mean a lot of people know what bloggers have but not everybody know what they are you can become a real estate blogger something i have actually not mentioned on this channel is the fact that i do have a blog i have a website where i write about you know personal finance i write about you know the location around me or places where i visit so that is a website that actually is handing me some money through uh, you know google hearts and advert so you can actually become a real estate blogger and what you'll be doing is that you will be writing everything that you can write about ghana real estate and something really very important about being a blogger is that you're not just writing for yourself you are writing information that will help people because that is the thing is all about value you have to provide value before you expect people to come to your website you constantly consistently provide valuable content and people will where well, google will rank your website and then you can suddenly become the expert in when it comes to ghana real estate this is something that a lot of people don't talk about because when you're talking about real estate you know people don't talk about this kind of thing like you know becoming a blogger what a lot of people don't know is that youtube pay people 
per the view that people watch. Of course, there are a lot of requirements before you can actually monetize on YouTube. But the bottom line is the fact that if you consistently, if you start a YouTube channel and you are talking about mainly about real estate in Ghana, it's not really going to be long before your channel is going to be recognized and people will be coming to your channel for information. And again, it's just like blog as well. It has to be that you're providing valuable content, valuable information that people will be coming to your channel to, uh, to find. So that itself is a business in the kind of like Ghana real estate world. You can become a podcaster as well. I'm putting all these kind of like a content base together. So you can become a podcaster. So whereby, you know, you are only talking about Ghana real estate. That is a business opportunity on its own because is the only way um, you know becoming a blogger or youtuber or podcaster is that you have to do it consistently for a long period of time and then that can actually become a business because soon sooner or later you will be the one that is the expert the go-to person when it comes to ghana real estate so which is the reason why you know becoming a, a podcaster you just need your microphone well you know it doesn't really have to be expensive microphone it could just be a microphone that is just good enough and you can actually find a lot of information on, on google as well on youtube how to become a podcaster and then before you know it, you become expert and any money so you can become interior decorator because you know people now really want their house to look really nice inside you know, you will be doing a good job, you know, to the kind of like uh, people that are, oh yeah, middle class or upper class <laughs> people. It's all about, you know, learning and putting yourself out there and doing so a little bit of marketing yourself. And then before you know it, you can become expert and you can be earning money in Ghana real estate. A lot of people don't know that, you know, you can be a landscape expert because being a landscape expert just means that you're helping people with their lawn and then you are helping the people to, you know, cut all those hedges, you know, all those houses, you know, you cannot just um, become expert in, in that sort of area, you know, among the middle class and upper class, and then you just be making money through that and that is a business on its own you can actually be doing photos and videos and the very interesting part of this is that you can do drone you can use drone to do um you know photo and video and it's just like it doesn't really matter whether some people are doing it already you know it's just about putting a touch of excellence into what you do and when you do that you know you can actually become different and then be unique and then you know before you know it you'll be making money in Ghana real estate and that is the one that really I don't really think there are too many you know drone uh, pilot that deal with real estate that is on its own a lot of real estate uh, agents now they will like especially when they are selling all those houses that are really very expensive houses they would love to have a drone shot and then through that you can become expert and you can earn money through that my next one is online estate agent so you know with the we you know the world is actually really moving on you know there are like in the uk where i live you know there are a lot of online estate agents whereby you know they don't really have any offices everything is done online so you know you can actually become online estate agent because that itself is really a big way as well in terms of like making money because you know you might be thinking yeah there are a lot of estate agents already online one but you can actually make your own difference it's all about a touch of excellence in fact when some people when people are doing something already it's actually a good sign that you know you also you can actually get in there and actually put a touch of excellence and be different and then you can stand out what about repairs you can just be there helping people to fix a lot of things you have you know plumbing problem you have electrical problem you know you can do this really really big time all you have to do is to train and then also before you know it, you can have multiple people that will be working for you so you literally have your own company whereby you have a lot of you know um plumber you have a lot of uh, you know electricians and all of that that are working under you and so you you just position yourself and then you will be the one that will be the go-to when they want to repair things 
and this is an area as well that a lot of people don't really take too serious because it's just a matter of you know doing it differently than the way people are already doing it and that is a good opportunity as well that you can make money from when you talk about cleaning people look at it like uh you know cleaning is like a dirty job and all of that see you know cleaning you can become industrial cleaner I'm not talking about you are the one literally cleaning, but you have a lot of people under you that are working for you. I mean, you can start it on your own and then before you know, you get, get to uh, people together and then they will be working for you. You can just help people that, are, for example, again, people that have Airbnb, for example, you know, they will be looking, they might not be living at that particular location. And then if you put yourself, uh, your service there out there, that you are really doing it in a different way than the way normal people are doing it you will just you know build yourself a business empire whereby you have a lot of people under you that be helping you to clean houses to clean offices industrial areas that is a business opportunity that many people don't ever think about you can sell unique furnishing you know you can furnish houses for people so and you know this one isn't really about actually uh, furnishing the houses alone but you can actually sell unique you know indoor interior decorator going back to interior decorator so that isn't really the interior decorator but you are the one selling those materials you know all those portions that will make the house to look wow so you know you can be selling those so that is actually a niche on its own which is under the real estate um, industry in ghana because the middle class is growing i constantly say that because you know this is the same actually in um some of those you know top african country whereby you know the middle class are really massively growing that will actually you can position yourself and sell you know unique you know poly, uh, furnishing that people will need to actually use to furnish their houses usually when the house is developed usually you will have different elements of the house so you have the roof you have the um you know the laying of bricks you have the you know digging the ground you have the plumbing part you have the electrical part in you know, all of these different parts they are actually done by subcontractor you know don't get me wrong there are developer who have all of this under their umbrella but a lot of them they just have different companies that do various parts you can actually become a subcontractor in a particular area it might be electrician electrical part you might be you know plumbing part you might be you know even fixing kitchen or something like that so that is really opportunity as well that you can actually become an expert in one particular um sub part of um you know uh, the stages of building a house and that actually can become a way that you have to actually build a business anyway i I hope somebody find this video useful if you find this video useful, let me know what you think about this video in the comment box below and thanks for watching and god bless